Hey guys, Eclipse14 here, and welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario RPG. Alright, so we're actually officially about to enter the Barrel Volcano at this point, after doing a bunch of optional stuff over the last two episodes. And, uh, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, make our way down, and have some fun. Because, uh, Barrel Volcano is going to be a wild dungeon. What am I doing? I keep thinking that going to the Hot Springs is that way. In reality, you gotta jump down, and then down this hole, and we face the hot springs, which I can just, uh, dive to recover. And take a nice dive into the volcano. Oh boy, I can't believe we're doing this. But we are. Okay, so we got a lot of enemies to fight. Magnus and Armor Dance. Guys are just everywhere. Pretty sure Snowy does a lot of damage, but uh, I'm just gonna sit with that and uh, of course the armor is still very, very tough. Not tough enough to handle a big ass lazy shell. Now I think about it, do I still have the signal ring? Uh, do I still have the signal ring equipped on Mario? Yeah, I do still have the signal ring. Damn it. Alright, let's have the experience booster. And forget about the Zoom Shoes, let's put the uh, Ghost Metal on you. That would work out for you. Well, that was a mistake. But yeah, we'll face every enemy we can go through, because, uh... Oh, that was a mistake. Takes you out, and we're good to go. Yeah, every little experience counts. Especially since we are getting ever so closer to getting to, uh... Oh, of course the dry bones come up. So, oh, that's a volcano. Hey, why are you in the volcano vortex? Okay, um... Star Rain, screw it. That gets rid of you entirely. I can take out this Donkey Kong one of There we go. That's done. Alright, 18 points and 8 coins for that, and Mario reaches level 27. Awesome. 200 HP, how about that? Pretty sure, yep, that's it. And, uh... Not too much farther from Mario before he finally reaches, uh, the cap. That experience booster can go to somebody else when it's all said and done. I keep doing that, I keep thinking, I keep forgetting Geno World just blows them apart. That, and there's another flower. Cool stuff. And, uh... Another Thunderbolt will do fine. Hit that, and... Geno Whirl. Just get rid of him. Nuked! We got a bracer out of that. I guess that's nice. Right up there, a bunch of coins, which is fine. Now that the option, optional stuff is expensive enough, I'm actually not having to want to drain all of my coins just to, uh, not be near cap. Alright. Oh, Superstar. Well, I guess I'm running through here. I'm just, uh... A couple enemies. And... Bunch of enemies just got deleted. Anything that direction? No. I thought. Okay. Okay, so all that got taken out. Go ahead and head this direction. And more of these guys. Great. Um. Thunderbolt. I 
gets rid of you. I'm gonna do your world to get rid of the chain call. Nuked. Big fat nuke. Oh, max mushroom, that's not bad. Alright, next one. Same stuff. Thunderbolts get rid of the bomber. Gino World to nuke away the Kong. Look at that, there's actually a frog coin right in the lava. Alongside uh Pyrospheres. Uh, Thunderbolt, see what happens. Uh, fair stuff, I guess. Um what the hell? I'll genoblast. There we go, that's a little more tolerable. And, uh, jump for good measure. Get nuked, Kong! There we go! That's pretty easy, and Toad still hits 22. In which case, uh, hey, 69 defense, how about that? That's two. Well, that is the correct one anyway. Yeah, the, uh, level ups dropped significantly in HP. Oh well. And that was a one hit kill. Making that one a joke. Now, if I can. Yeah, if you can make a far a quick enough jump to get the frog coin, you can. But uh fortunately you don't lose HP doing this. I'm just whacking that. Uh whatever. Frog coins are overrated anyway. But uh yeah, I figure if you if you can aim for the uh I'm gonna go for snowy here. If you can get your hands on that frog coin, good for you. I'm just uh, showing you kind of how to get to it, but uh, I can't really do just a straight up running jump. Alright, Snowy definitely took care of that. And handles that one! Alright, I'll just focus more on enemies and just keep rolling. Oh, I'm low as can be. Perfect! That gives me the opportunity to use that flower jar. Got an energizer out of that, apparently. Alright, flower jar. Got it. 87 points. How about that? Okay, moving on. Go ahead and keep fighting these things. Because it's all uh, for good reason. I think now I'm just gonna fight normally. With relatively few points needed for some of these. I got it once again, how about that? I'm gonna Geno Whirl. I can afford it. There we go. No, oh, I just get to sit all the way back to the back. Alright, I'll just leave it at that and be done with it. And here comes another one of these dry bones. Alright, you know what to do. Thunderbolt. I don't have any pure water for this. I'm gonna jump instead. 68 works. 
And I'm officially at 10 minutes into this burning inferno. Great. Yeah, there's frog coins everywhere, but uh, at this point, they're more or less moot for me. Wow, 344 with a lazy shell. I did not expect that kind of damage. Hey, pure water. How about that? Hey, Gina leveled up. Sweet. Got all that weak stuff, and, uh... It is HP. Of course it is. Alright. And four more enemies to go. Oh, come on! Alright, Thunderbolt. There we go. All gone. Likewise, another explosion of thunder. That takes them all out. Easy stuff. Mars up 28. Well then. That goes to... HP? Yep. I got this. Wow, what the heck is this? Well, I'm gonna end up facing it soon. But there's a flower right there, and a safe block right there, with a frog coin right there. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this block, and I'm gonna save, because it's approaching 12 minutes. And I'm gonna close this episode here, and we'll continue on next episode. With that said, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.